I'm Charles McCain. The book I'm going to review now is called Hitler's Gray Wolves, U-Boats in the Indian Ocean by Lawrence Patterson. And one of the things that makes a book like this interesting and worth reading is it presents an aspect of the war, the U-Boat War, that most people are completely unaware of. And that is the operation of German U-boats throughout the Indian Ocean area and the surprise that British ships and, and other merchant ships would sort of feel when they got torpedoed by a German U-boat in the Indian Ocean. Uh, the Germans based some of these U-boats out of occupied Japanese-occupied Singapore and other bases around uh, that area. And here again, most people are unaware that there was a no there were a number of German U-boats based um, in that area with the permission of the Japanese, of course. And although they didn't have a great effect, they did certainly go around and sink ships. And it's quite interesting. They weren't, of course, designed to operate in that kind of temperature either. And so it was miserable to be on the boat because it would take on the temperature of the water. So if the water was 95 degrees or 90 degrees, with the heat from the engines, it'd be 110 degrees in the boat all the time, which you can imagine made for a pretty miserable experience for weeks at a time. Uh, I give it four stars. Hitler's Grey Wolves, U-Boats in the Indian Ocean, quite a good read.